Have you ever contemplated moving to Portugal for work? Well, the Portuguese government has opened up an exciting avenue for you in 2024, the Job Seeker Visa. It's an innovative concept that's designed for individuals who are eager to explore employment opportunities in Portugal. The unique aspect of this visa is that you don't need to secure a job offer from the Portuguese government to apply. Yes, you heard it right. This visa grants you the opportunity to reside in Portugal for a span of 120 days, giving you ample time to dive into the job market and find your ideal job. So, whether you're a seasoned professional or a fresh graduate, this visa could be your ticket to a new career journey in Portugal. Imagine the opportunities that lie ahead for you in Portugal. Let's dive into the process of applying for this visa. What exactly is the Job Seeker Visa, you may ask? Well, let's unpack that. The Job Seeker Visa, recently introduced by the Portuguese government, is a fantastic opportunity for individuals around the globe to explore the vibrant Portuguese job market. This visa allows you to reside in Portugal for a period of 120 days, giving you ample time to immerse yourself in the local culture, network and search for a job that suits your skills and aspirations. But it doesn't stop there. If you need more time, the visa is renewable for an additional 60 days. That's a total of 180 days, or about 6 months, to find your ideal job in Portugal. Now, it's important to note that this is a single entry visa. This means that once you enter Portugal, you should plan to stay within the country for the duration of your visa validity. This gives you uninterrupted time to focus on your job search and get a feel for living in Portugal. One of the great advantages of the Job Seeker Visa is that it empowers you to find employment and then apply for a residence permit. Once you secure a job and formalize your employment contract, you can apply for a residence permit, provided you fulfill the general conditions stipulated by the law. This transition can be a game changer, paving the way for a longer stay in Portugal and potentially a new chapter in your career. The Job Seeker Visa truly opens up a world of opportunities in Portugal. Now let's talk about what happens when the visa expires. What happens when your Job Seeker Visa expires? A question that can certainly raise some eyebrows. So let's delve into it. Firstly, it's crucial to understand that once your Job Seeker Visa reaches its maximum validity limit without a job offer or the initiation of a residence permit application, you must depart from the beautiful shores of Portugal. It might sound a bit harsh, but rules are rules, and we all must abide by them. However, this is not the end of your journey. You can dust off your dreams and reapply for a new Job Seeker Visa, but only one year after the expiry of the previous one. This gives you ample time to regroup, reassess your strategies, and come back stronger. Extending your visa? Absolutely, you can. But it comes with its own set of prerequisites. You must provide proof of registration with the IEFP, IP, and a declaration stating that the conditions of your stay remain unchanged. This will be evaluated based on the reasons that justified the issuance of your visa in the first place. But let's not worry about the visa expiry just yet. Let's focus on getting you to Portugal first. So, how do you apply for the Job Seeker Visa? Well, it's a process that requires a bit of preparation and a handful of documents. Let's break it down. Firstly, the general documentation needed includes a duly signed national visa application, a valid passport or other travel document, two photos, a criminal record certificate, and valid travel insurance that covers necessary medical expenses. You'll also need a copy of your return transport ticket and proof of financial resources equivalent to at least three times the guaranteed monthly minimum salary. Now, if you're thinking, that's a lot of money, don't fret. The proof of financial resources can actually be waived if a Portuguese citizen or a foreign citizen with legal residence in Portugal provides a term of responsibility. This means they're guaranteeing food, accommodation and repatriation costs for you. In addition to the general documentation, there are also specific documents required. You'll need to provide your own statement outlining the conditions of your planned stay. This will be assessed considering the reasons that justified the issuance of your visa. You will also need to register with the IEFP, IP, and provide proof of this registration. Now, you may be wondering, where do I apply? There are a couple of important links you'll need to visit. The first is the official website for visa documentation, which is vistos.emine.gov.pt.here. You'll find all the information you need about the Job Seeker Visa. The second link is the IEFP's website, where you can register and submit your declaration of interest for enrollment. The link is IEFPPPT. Finally, you'll need to visit formularios.efppt to apply for the visa. 
Remember, preparation is key. Make sure you have all your documents ready and follow the process carefully to ensure a smooth application. With all these documents in hand, you are all set to apply for your job seeker visa. Let's recap what we have learned today. The Portuguese job seeker visa, a golden opportunity issued by the Portuguese government, grants individuals the chance to reside in Portugal for a period of 120 days, with a possible renewal for another 60 days. It allows for a single entry into Portugal and is designed to help you find a job. This visa is not just a ticket to Portugal, but also a pass to work in a subordinated activity until either the visa expires or a residence permit is granted. The granting of this visa also implies a scheduled appointment within the visa's validity period, allowing you to formalize an employment contract and apply for a residence permit. However, it's crucial to remember that if no employment relationship has been established, or if you haven't started the process of requesting a residence permit by the time the visa expires, you'll need to leave the country. In such situations, you can reapply for a new visa one year after the previous visa's expiry. Applying for the Job Seeker visa involves providing a range of documents, including a duly signed national visa application, a valid passport, photos, proof of regular status, a criminal record certificate, valid travel insurance and proof of financial resources equivalent to at least three times the guaranteed minimum monthly salary. Specific documents also include a declaration of interest for enrollment in the IEFP and a statement indicating the conditions for the estimated stay. With the right preparation and determination, your dream of working in Portugal could soon become a reality. Best of luck with your application!